Edward Snowden says he's open to helping Brazil investigate U.S. spying on one condition. In an open letter published in a Brazilian newspaper, the former NSA contractor suggested he could help the South American nation probe NSA surveillance only if he's granted asylum. Snowden's leaks earlier this year revealed the NSA had been monitoring the cell phone of Brazilian President Duma Rousseff. It caused such an uproar she called off a state visit with President Obama. Snowden writes in the letter, Until a country grants permanent political asylum, the U.S. government will continue to interfere with my ability to speak. The whistleblower is currently living in Russia, where he's been given one year of temporary asylum. While there had been some talk of possible amnesty for Snowden, Monday the White House said there was no chance. There's been no change in our position. He has been uh, charged and accused of leaking classified information. He faces felony charges here. He ought to be returned to the United States, again, where he will face full due process and protection. Those remarks came the same day Snowden praised a federal judge's ruling that the NSA's bulk collection of phone records was probably unconstitutional. Meanwhile, the NSA is still trying to figure out just how much data Snowden took, but as one U.S. official told the New York Times, we may never know the extent of his leaks. The Guardian recently said it had published only 1% of the material Snowden gave the newspaper. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn, Multiple Sources, A Broader View.